I enjoy so much of your talk and um, I don't want to discuss uh, whether or not uh, uh, I mean media should live broadcast the, the president's uh, daily daily breathing. That's another issue but I want to discuss on whether or not reporters should ask president the president questions because a while ago you were saying that you know knowingly that he might give some false information, disinformation, misinformation, then probably uh, uh, reporters shouldn't be asking him questions. But now the White House briefing is, uh, you know, the, the correspondence there are to cover the president. Of course, they are covering news as well, and, and the news and the, what pre the president say should not be mutually exclusive. But you know, the White House correspondent's job is to cover the president, whatever he said, and he should be take responsible for what he is telling the fellow Americans, but not the reporters to scan the authenticity of what he is saying. Yeah, well, yeah, Trump, Trump should do that, but he doesn't do that. Um, and it's a bit funny that people still think that he will do that. And this, one of my original points for this was going to be that people, people were considering that Trump's behavior uh, might change completely because of this. Um, and every time he's, he said he changed his, he read a, a nice speech or he seemed to show a little sympathy, the journalists would get very excited and say, wow, he changed now. But eventually it, it wouldn't, he would go back to the, to the old ways of doing it. Um, it's, I think it's, kind of a trap, right? And Trump has been doing this for a very long time for trapping journalists, because they he knows that he has this power that whenever he speaks, people will just rush over and listen to what he's saying, right? It's part of his his narcissism and in, in his, you know, is wanting to get all of this attention. So he knows that he can do that in order to, to trap journalists even, and he will use it just to speak uh, for to help him get reelected or to help his ego or something like that instead of giving information. So the you know it's this catch twenty two right that he's important he's going to say something but he's going to lie and spin but we have to cover what he says even though he's not going to tell us the truth right which is why like a lot of the people I mentioned were saying that well cover it but don't cover it live 